Mmm. Tastes like bread. Mmm. Tastes like corn. Went down this street and I noticed there's lots of blood, blood on the floor, like just obviously cut the steps down. Some some guys just cut up a whole bloody cow on the floor, so I took a sharp detour to the right and ended up in so what looked like some bloody prosy alleyway. Yo, <coughs> what is up, guys? I'm back. When was the last time you see me? Uh, oh, coming outside your mum's house. Hey, because she's a. Sh uh. <laughs> anyway, what's up? I'm in Turkey, Antalya, Antalya, something like Antalya. <laughs> however, however it's pronounced. <sighs> it's been a while. It's been really good. Four or five months from that, maybe. I don't know. Anyway, it's February now. It's raining. I'm not excited this sunny destination. I was thinking, what, why do I always go to these places in the off season? I don't know. Either way, it's quiet. It's not raining now. It's pretty chilled. There's lots of cats everywhere. Meow. There were some dogs fighting over a car before. Hello, is the car? Is literally biting the car. Just sat there and watched. What have I done so far? Well, I got here yesterday. Uh, yeah, done now. No. Oh, very cute. Very cute, eh? Anyway, I've done now. I've had two donut kebabs. Absolutely gorgeous. Love them. Gotta have more of them. Um, so today I was just planning on. I wasn't going to film, but then I was walking about. It's lovely around here, so I thought I'd just whip out the camera, whip, whip, whip up the camera, and say hello to the few years that still watch these amazing videos. I'm just here in Antalya to chill out by the bay. I managed to climb, I managed to climb the way all the way over here without falling or dropping anything. Almost dropped my wallet before, but never mind. So what's the plan? Obviously, starting in Antalya, going to see, travel a bit around Turkey for a couple of weeks, head to Egypt, possibly Jordan, depending on um, depend on like PCR tests and stuff. I don't really spend a hundred quid just to get in a country, to be honest. Look how gorgeous this place is, man. Yeah, so obviously Cappadocia, that'll be the place to go next, I think. Pamukil. I don't know, I don't know any of the names to be honest. Um, a couple of awesome places to go see in Turkey, so that's that's top of my priority. Obviously, it's not it's not sunny. However, I'm pretty warm already, I'm not gonna lie, I am fancy putting my shorts on. But I'm gonna go chill out. I want a Turkish coffee and I'll see you all there. First bit of blogging, blogging as we do. Just stopped off for some tea. Uh, views of the bay, as you can see, absolutely gorgeous. Some guy at the bottom was like. Uh, you're not cool because I'm not even wearing a jacket. Everyone's wearing troopers and stuff like that. I'm like, no, I'm here to boil. <laughs> I thought it was from the army. So you're from the from the army. It's like, no, I'm just just got no style, mate. So guys, I'm at the at the park. Found my way here. 
had a little cut down some side rally before because I thought it, was, it would take me down. Well, thought it would take me take me down there, right? Start walking down this street, and I noticed there's lots of blood blood on the floor. Like just obviously a couple of steps down, some some guys just cut up a whole bloody cow on the floor. So I took a sharp detour to the right, ended up in so what looked like some bloody prosy alleyway. Then some guy approached me like, "What are you doing here?" I was like, "Uh, I'm just looking." <laughs> He's like, oh, okay. And I was like, well, what, what's down there? He's like, oh, go see. I was like, I'm not walking through a pool of blood. Time to try some of this Turkish bread. I've seen it on the internet before I came. I was like, well, I'll have to have a try when I got it. It's like five, four tickets here. Or 20 pence, man. Mmm. Just like bread. Need some butter. That bread's kind of stuck down, like here. So solid. Look at this. Let's see, I don't know if you can see. I don't know if you can see my dodgy nail. Actually, probably should have come. Anyway, what was it? A sandwich and some some dodgy looking yogurt drink for 19.90 Turkish lira. Just over one pound. It's crazy. That's it. Yeah, just over one pound for a sandwich and a yogurt, dodgy drink. I might go get one as well. So nice. Spicy, Emma. So I got cost me about fifty pence, I guess. Some there, ten tips there. Mmm. Spicy. Did ask for it, label. Oh yeah. Mmm. Tastes like corn. Special kebab, I think it's kofta kebab by the looks of it. Doesn't say it like but looks lovely. 75 as well, that's 246, 350. Man. That's Hadrian's Gate. Uh, I don't really know much about it. However, obviously Hadrian's Wall in Newcastle, Hadrian's Gate here. Eh? Travel a long way, that wall. All the locals in coats and trousers and stuff like that. I seen the best one, so I was like, let's get the shorts on. No one else is wearing shorts. So I think I'm just gonna go find a bar in the sun. Chill out. I've no idea where I'm walking like. Just through the little alleyways. Yeah, so find a bar in the sun, chill out in the sun. That's my step. That's the move today. I'll see you shoot with the wild like. Peace. Yo, so I'm a few beers down. I feel a bit tipsy for I'm honest, I've got some um I was going to get a kebab then I found this place some guy on the plane said fish sandwich is the best thing in Turkey so I'm getting one now I think it cost 40 it's like about £2, 220 230 now uh, it looks like it's going to be lush the food has arrived 
and I've just sat down on a very wet chair and my ass is soaking. But never mind, let's have a look. We've got some fried mussels. They're a bit soft, but uh, a fish sandwich, no sauce. I wonder if you can go add sauce. I might go add some sauce to it. Um, so I'm gonna, I'll try one of the mussels while we're here. It's a bit soft. Nice. I'm gonna go try and add some sauce to this sandwich. Right, you wait a minute, I'll tell for this. Went a bit overboard. Add some lemon. Add some tartar sauce. Fresh orange. Maybe I'll just squeeze like 10 oranges here. What, 15? 15 Turkish liters, about a quid, 100 quid. Can you go wrong sitting in the sun again? <laughs> it's so sweet. Right, guys. Right, guys, what? Uh, what's happening? What is happening? So I've been came back in after it's been sunny all day, chilled out for a little bit, about to go out and get some more beer. Because it's um, Friday, gonna have some bands on, listen to some bands, probably bring you along see what the crack is. I'm not too sure how long I'll stay out for anyway, but what? 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 What's that? How good am I looking at? <laughs> anyway, this is this is the hotel room. Bed, that's normally where I sleep. There's a fridge, kettle. If you never tried this, apple tea, it is the boy. Had some um, raki, disgusting. Never buy it. It's disgusting. It's, it's like absent. No, it's not absent. It's like what you call it? Jeez, oh, I've got a few beers. Uh, it's like sambuca, black sambuca, aniseed. Oh yeah, that's it. Honestly, that's what I meant to say. Disgusting. Don't ever buy it. However, two beers and one of them rakis. It's about five pounds, so I don't really give a shit. Drank it all. <coughs> Never mind. Right, I'm gonna go find some some stuff. I was with these Germans before. Chilling out, they were like, Come dance. I was like, Pff. Cheers! 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 Thank you! Thank you! Thank you!
It's been a hard morning. <laughs> um, what happened? So, I was listening to some live music, started chatting this guy next to us. Then these two Turkish people, Lad and Alas, started to, um, talking to us as well. It was pretty crazy. Like then, then some other people had just got a big crowd of table somehow. Anyway, it was a good night. So as you can see, that's Durden Waterfall. I'm on the tour today, obviously, I didn't actually get to say this in the start, because I was late. But anyway, we're going to see Perges, Aspendos and Siede, all ancient Roman cities. So I'm just going to be travelling around looking at that on this big-ass tour. 8 o'clock start, up at 7, didn't sleep. Great. Anyway, look at the waterfall. Beautiful. So I'm just here at Fierce. I think that's how you pronounce it anyway. Just been wandering around with the tour guides, it's been awesome. Crazy how much history is in Turkey like. Um, just chilling out, having a walk back now. I think next we're going to um, see the app, giant amphitheatre, which I'm looking forward to. Obviously one of the facts the, the tour guide we faster was saying, apparently the, the first Olympic Games, they all fought naked, but they didn't think they were naked because they, <laughs> they weren't circumcised. I thought, that's an interesting fact, isn't it? So now you know, first Olympic Games, everyone's naked. Anyway, back to the tour. From the ground to up here, it's huge. Next, I think after this is dinner, so I'm looking forward to that. And see that day, another ancient town, got to see that as well. Uh, yeah, probably actually do. They actually do um, actual theatre productions on here still. This is still a working theatre, which I think is pretty cool. Imagine coming to see a show here. Anyway, I'm just going to chill out here. We've got half an hour, so I'm just going to sit and relax. I'll see you in a bit. Peace. So this is the Temple of Artemis in Siede. Pretty beautiful place. This whole area is absolutely gorgeous. As you can see, kind of just over there, but that way. See the sea, absolutely beautiful. Well, this is the nicest area I've been. Weather's lovely today. It's crazy. So I've got some free time to walk about, explore the city of Siede, uh, and have some fun. I met a Geordie guy here and his wife. Uh, pretty cool, eh? He's, he's had two beers already, so I might, catch, I might have one. But I know as soon as I get on that 40 minute bus ride home, I'll be pissing every two seconds. But yeah, it's beautiful this place.
an old, just at the supermarket, not the supermarket, shopping mall. This is the beer. Finished the tour off. Not really too sure what I said. But anyway, I'm just gonna, I walk in the mall. I have to take pay. Did do a COVID test again? But um, they didn't even ask for it to be he, he asked them and then um, just ignored me after I tried to give him something. Anyway, so I'm just gonna have a wander around here. I'll show you what it's like. See the shop's name? Mango Man. I just found that funny. Mango Man. Whatever. <laughs> 